ingrained part of our collective internet culture. No, our society. This is due in no small part to their rabid, vocal, and multicolored minority. The majority of our neon-furred friends, however, lived in peace in their own self-sustaining cycle of commerce. From the paws of the somehow abundantly wealthy furry to the aesthetic hands of their furry artists, they create things ranging from fan art to lewd to straight-up cinematic masterpieces until they themselves become abundantly wealthy. And thus, the cycle continues, but we are missing a key step. How did the furries become wealthy in the first place? The answer? The black market. That's right. I'm here to say that furries are capturing and maiming their own kind and selling their pelts in the black market. And before you start hitting the oo-woos and the oh-woes and the oh-noes, let me show you the facts. The most popular fursona species include wolves, foxes, dogs, large felines, and dragons. Wolves alone can net you $210, which in the grand scheme of things, is not a lot. But in the eyes of an artist on Twitter who sold their soul in the first place to make this smut, it's a lot. God forbid they managed to snag a tiger. Their pelts can fetch upwards of $20,000. And dragons are mythical creatures, so you already know you can rival Bill Gates in terms of absurd, money-wasting cash, which you then spend on a picture of Tony the Tiger railing your My Little Pony ship. Sick fuck. We're not even gonna touch the kind of money that they can make after they skin the suit like an onion and find the would-be remains of a one human being. No, no, don't, don't look at that. Don't look at that. We're not, we're not touching that. Don't, don't get it. We even have definitive proof that this is happening. Just last year, on November 20th, a trans species named William Tenenbaum, age 31, was poached after getting caught roaming through the woods. What happened to him after this news report? No one knows. Is that me? So I hope you enjoy your blood money, you Twitter animals. You're feeling this never-ending orgy of bloodshed. Flashback. Mike, I, I can explain. It's just for the video, Mike. Mike, listen, I swear. It, it's research. It's research. I'm gonna leave. Nigga. Yo, is he gone? Yeah, we good, we good. So about these fucking big-ass furry titties.